the most important skills uh, according to your opinion and your personal experience uh, while you are driving a car? You have to be mentally very stable, um, it's uh, super demanding physically, it's, it's, it's a mix of uh, being uh, courage and brave but also sensibility and technique and um, constance and experience is a, is a very big key point. So you have to be brave and you have to be really fit and focused and, and in the end also smart. Oh, it's a, it's a lot of experience, I think, to drive cars like this. You know, you, you don't just get in and drive a race car. You learn, you, you do go-karting, you do slower cars, less power, and then uh, you kind of build your way up. But I think you need to have a certain level of uh, aggression, a certain level of confidence, um, and obviously, yeah, just the learnt skill because it takes a lot of time and a lot of practice like any other sport. Your favorite uh, pilot in the story? Michelle Mouton. She's my favorite pilot because she has been a really tough woman. The period was really not uh, for... Girls were not considered in motorsport or not even in normal life, so... for. For me, she is one of the first big heroes we had, we had in the past. When did you start to, to drive a car in, and in what kind of competition? Uh, when I was nine years old, so a long, long time ago. <laughs> nine years old. Um, in England, British, and it was a go-kart. And then I did go-karting for ten years, where you learn how to race. Um, you know, wheel to wheel and... Uh, and then you kind of progress on up through the ranks. I started at the age of 12 years. I started in go-karting. And uh, yeah, first I did go-karting, then I moved up to Formula Sport. I won races as the first females in certain championship. And then I was lucky enough to get um, an official contract. And this is how or when I moved to GT cars. And over 10 years now, I'm in the GT business. Thank you so much for this amazing experience with you today.